I randomly came across this strip loin slab roast in the frozen section of Shopwise Supermarket. I've never cooked one and had no plans, but with my new sous vide machine and that bargain of a price, I couldn't pass it up. So join me today as I try to cook this strip loin slab roast sous vide style. As with most of everything that I cook, it all begins with a hefty portion of garlic. You'll see that this is actually two slabs of strip loin tied together with a twine. And despite being a strip loin, this beef has almost no marbling of fat in its meat. At that bargain of a price, it's undoubtedly local and not grated, but anyway, what we're trying to discover today is if slow cooking can tenderize this large piece of unmarbled meat. A good amount of salt, pepper, and rosemary to hopefully get the best out of this slab of beef. And we mustn't of course forget our sliced garlic. Once covered with spices, we place the slab into the sous vide bags and vacuum seal with our trusted manual hand pump. Today we'll be cooking this slab at 53 degrees centigrade for over 3 and a half hours. Since we've got some time, I'm making some mashed potatoes to make this a real festive meal. I boil some potatoes over 20 minutes or just until the water completely evaporates. I like my potatoes rustic so I don't bother peeling off the skin. Mash and mix in some melted butter, milk, salt, and pepper and our carbs are set. Of course those potatoes then take all of 3 hours. I actually took a nap before making those. With those ready, our meat is almost done and we now take it out of the sous vide to finish off. While this makes for great visuals, this thick slab of meat actually took a while for me to brown with his torch gun. Next time, I'd honestly rather go with a pantier finish to keep the heat even. Lesson learned that as the meat has cooked over a low temperature, it of course loses that heat easily as well. Cutting through the meat, I was a bit worried that it was a little dry and not as pink as I had hoped. But as I got closer to the middle, the color and texture was much better. I think I needed to have it rest a bit more. Hey guys, so it's been about 4 hours. This seems to be local beef without any marbling. I think it's still pretty tough. Let's see how the strip loin slab roast is gonna end up. Hmm. Well, now that it's settled down a little bit, there's a bit more of pink flowing. Admittedly, not as juicy as I would have hoped. It's rather tasty because it's just really an unmarbled piece of meat. It's really hard to get it any juicier than this. It, I think it's decent. I think with a gravy, it would work really well and it's a roast beef anyway. So. so how would I rate it? How would I rate my experiment? So probably this is at best a 6.5. So I'm thinking about a 6 to 6.5 over 10. Maybe you really need to invest in better grades or better quality of beef. This roast is going to be enough to feed all of us here tonight in the family. So, so if you've liked this video, please like, comment, and subscribe and if you haven't already. And I'll see you again next time.